All right, so in here we're going to try and figure out what so happens to be wrong with this MacBook. Let's see what's wrong with this MacBook and if it can be fixed. Here we have Mark. If I screw anything up, Mark is here to fix the problem, free of charge. Mark said that if I die on my buffet while I'm riding home, that if that occurs, that I will not have to pay him for the time that he spent here. So, will be taking your desktop from your house. Because I will be dead. And your cats. So I have an excellent incentive at this point. I have an excellent incentive to not survive my Bafang ride. All right, so let's see what's wrong with this MacBook. So first things first, this MacBook takes an, a full amp with the battery not plugged in, which is absolutely insane. When running, this thing should be taking 500 milliamps. Charging the battery, it should be taking maybe an amp and a half. But that, that, is, that is crazy. So something here has to be burning. So we're going to get this MacBook out of the system and see what's wrong with it. By the way, everybody watching should check out Mark Schaefer's channel. Go to Mar you, All you do is you have to search for Mark Schaefer, S-H-A-F-F-E-R. Let's see, where it is my T5 screwdriver? Here, little T5. Here, little T5, 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 T5. I can't whistle. If I could whistle, I'd be able to find it. Yeah, there's no, the people, wanna, people are waiting to see me crash. It's like NASCAR. Everybody likes to pretend that they're watching NASCAR because they're really interested in the race and the technique. No, they're just, they're just waiting for somebody to... Really like watching cars turn left. All right, so let's take a look over this 820-00165 board and see if we can figure out what's wrong with it. MacBook. This MacBook took an amp, didn't turn on, and then sat at 20 milliamps. Hmm. By the way, everybody, tell me what you think of the stream quality on Vimeo, Twitch, and YouTube. Which one's the best? I changed my settings a little bit, so I'm using my GPU to record the high bitrate copy, but CPU to with the encoder to encode the lower bitrate copy for streaming, which should look better. X264 is a much better encoder than NV Inc. I wonder what this is for. <laughs> what circuit could you possibly be attached to? All right, so Mark, what do you think this capacitor is for here? What's its purpose? It's for sending current to ground. Yeah, that, that's what this is for. That's its MacBook. purpose right now. So let's take a look on the schematic in the board view over here. So you are on pip 3 s 5 You are a capacitor on pip 3 s 5 that goes to the MUX for Thunderbolt. So this is, a U th this is a CD3211. This is the old Thunderbolt MUX prior to them using the CD3215 on the USB-C MacBooks. And let's see. I wonder if all we need to do on this MacBook is just toss that little cap off and maybe it'll work again. No, there's no way we would be that lucky. There's no way we would get a board that was that easy when Paul is sitting, trying to figure out what's going on on boards that have had 14 pads knocked off of them with jumpers wires run under them and <laughs> random chips replaced being ultrasonic so that you can't tell any where the any of the original damage is. There's no way that this would be that easy. No way at all. I gotta figure out how to reprogram my FM203. What do you have at home, Mark? Uh, 203. Do you, yeah, cause like when I pick this up, it still doesn't work unless I hit the S button. Hmm. But pause isn't like that. All right, so we we're gonna remove that capacitor with some grace. You, we're just gonna be as graceful as we can.
Ladies and gentlemen, do you hear that? That's the sound of success. That's the look of random. Look at that fan spin. Beautiful fast board repair. Record time. So that was a capacitor on the PP33S5 line that was shorted to ground. But now it's not shorted to ground. Is Mark getting hired by you, Lewis? Yes, he is moving to New York City with his family. Mm, yeah, about that. And he is taking Oreo with him. No, I just come and visit Oreo every once in a while. That's it. Oreo really misses you, Mark. I know. I miss him, too. Look, he's making strides. He cleaned his butt yesterday. <laughs> he did not. <laughs> he did so. You heard it. <laughs> I have a cat that doesn't like to clean itself that I'm trying to give to Mark. Yeah, it's not going to happen. Another happy little MacBook has been fixed through the immorality of using a donor board. That's it for today, and as always, I hope you learned something. Next up, Mark is going to fix an iPhone 10 that's boot looping that requires the board to be separated into pieces yeah. using nothing but the quick 861DW without a nozzle and no preheater. <laughs> and he's going to do it in one stream without a schematic, ZXW tool, or phone board. Mark? Mm -mm. <laughs> no, I'm, no means yes, right? I was watching Ilhan Omar testify at Congress the other day. Okay, so hi, hi, pick the next board at random for us. 